was not this is HD News Tech, so I'm going to ask something the best. We got a test about COVID last night. Apparently, this is like my first day of quarantine of um, having COVID. Don't know what version of COVID I got, but it is strep test. I, I sure thought I had sinus because I was so gaggy in the morning. Like, last two mornings, last three, really. So our throat for today, and then I think the pain is going to wear off in a few hours. We'll see how I find out this virus and see how good I. So far, my temperature is right around 97.1 or whatever. It's like perfect. And last night, I was like 98.5, which is getting up there a little bit with sleep. I thought for a lot of flame took it as a mess and cough up a lot of it got in me and then you know, vitamins, food, inhalers, you know, you name it, asthma and <laughs> <coughs> it's not fun experience, that's for sure. And uh if you think about going to Thanksgiving, uh make sure that you got a booster because I should have got a booster. For COVID. So now I can't get a vaccine, I think, for like 90 days. It's like I can't think of like a COVID shot. Um, because I have the virus. And um, even if you fight it off, those engines stay in there for a while. And uh, depending on the person's immune system, my history of the flu, like, Rarely do I catch anything flu related besides this mess. Um, Flame the lungs, you know, it has some hair, it came handy, I took care of that. Uh, be be uh, thankful for Thanksgiving, be careful, don't spread germs, don't. If you think someone is going to get sick or you feel like you're coming down with some get tested for COVID because it's not worth spreading it, trust me. I was probably running a temperature. I don't know what they would say what my temperature was, but uh, I just paused it. I got more calls. Like, okay, I got to leave work and get my bags and everything and take off like for five days or so. But they were committed for quarantine. Um, you know, don't. If you're gonna, you know, make food and all that, don't touch it with your bare hands. Like, get someone in the family too who is experienced in like food, like in school where they wear gloves and they get plates, you know, and they get the food. They don't use their own hands. They wash their hands. They put this up, their hands and gloves, gloves on their hands, and then they get the food to them. They don't just touch themselves, you know do it correctly or you know like don't pick your nose and then touch a cookie and eat it and then infect the rest of the family because it's not worth it trust me it's like this one there's a new version coming out and it's not worth it trust me <laughs> pretty much i'm coming out of it that's good it's just taking a while I may test positive for the antibodies for a while. The wet test for temperature has been pretty good. The mouth, why I usually do it. I think everyone that tells me like, hey, you're, it's good to get it. It's turned red or green. It's like, like green is all like, I'm good. So I don't know on the, you know, one of those sore ones and it. Replace the battery, so I use it so often to check my temperature in the last couple of years, and this is the first time catching COVID, I think, and testing positive for it and dealing with it. <coughs> there is definitely a lot of asthma um, issues. I think it's more asthma now. I think the phlegm part is done. I just gotta get these things back up to performance and uh, fight the rest of the thing off where else is left of this virus. Um, 
that you know, I drew my ass up, but I still take, you know, backup doses of inhalers just to back up my lungs. And I make a big deal for now, like one sooner or I had chest chest, like, you can't believe it, like, my whole chest was congested, like, I barely, barely, could, barely could breathe. That's how my COVID is. And I'm gonna tell you, know, like, don't, if you're sleeping, do not sit down, straight down, we're gonna get manga. I uh, luckily I had inhalers in my near me, not to get into me, to cough that flame up and get it out of my system, before it became ammonia, you know? The flame that came from the virus. So, uh, um, for now on, I'm sleeping up like that probably for another uh, week or two. Pills up, head propped up, chest propped up, you name it. So, you like, subscribe, comment like below. I know I'm still sick, I'm still taking, um, you know, my regular soda drinks at times. And, uh, So much to do better, but still not quite there yet. It's a little of that uh, hoarse voice, which is not not good, you know, for your YouTuber or anything like that. There's still a chance for me to test positive with the kids. I like to get some free, sorry, I test probably again. Hopefully tonight and see how much of a difference or I wait until tomorrow morning and see a bigger picture as it has went down over time with my immune system how, how I am. It's a little less red at times and it's like you have to test yourself once a day, I think like twice a day, so like I got one to do probably I should do one probably at seven PM. I got my vitamin D before I hang I knew I probably wouldn't get sick regardless because it's like you know, eight pills, like 5,000 units of vitamin D uh, without the carbs, without the calories, and it's a tablet that you can chew and it won't crack your teeth. I've been going off of that for a while, fight this thing off, as well as the vitamin C that my mom gave me to take, as well as the potatoes that you. You don't think potatoes have potassium, they got a lot. For like a three dollar bag, you can get like thirty percent potassium uh, I mean, uh, thirty percent um vitamin C. So like three of those. And it's like it's like ninety percent vitamin C. That's that's a good way to get it for vegetables, that's a true way to get it. Besides a thousand, which C gave me, like I had a couple of years ago with the COVID outbreak, I took it every now and then to keep me from getting sick. And before there was a vaccine, now I gotta wait 90 days or whatever for to get another booster. I caught it. Make sure to subscribe like below. Thanks for watching. I'm like gonna probably be arrested. Probably eating in probably about an hour or two and then resting a little bit, doing chores. Things need to be done. Like, you can't just sit down, like before, like a lot of people thought they could just rest, like the flu. You can't do that with COVID. Um, I did dishes, I did like, uh, you know, like my clothes, make sure that they're clean. When I get back to work, so I don't have any kind of contamination. And the laptop probably had your arm for like probably another 10, 20 days. I'm not taking a chance of bringing anything from, from here to there. When I get paid, I'll probably buy your lunch box because I have not as they broke the zipper. So uh, I'll get food that I can have that has a good amount of vitamin C in it to help when I get back because it does help a lot with me. It seems also like we do as well during the winter time. Thanks for watching. See you.